I'm Casey with the product design team here at Wandered, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the inflatable lens case. Uh, there's two things we love about the inflatable lens case. Uh, the first one is when it's not in use, it packs down into the small disc here. Uh, when you do decide you need to use it, you've got two elastic webbing straps on the top of it. Undo those and then expands, it's open, and you're ready to start storing away your lenses. Um, before you actually put the lenses inside of the lens case, uh, we recommend that you inflate the lens case. Um, and when you're inflating the lens case, make sure that you give it a big uh, blow of air and continue to blow and then tighten the valve here as you go. And I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate how to do that. Once you've got your valve tight, and you've got air uh, in the inflatable lens case, you can go ahead and unzip this top zipper here. Uh, it's a weather resistant zipper. All the materials used on the lens case are highly weather resistant. Uh, in the top of the lens case, you've actually got a, a foam divider. Um, and this allows you to carry multiple lenses in here if the size allows it. And I'll show you how to do that in just a minute. Um, but getting starting with, with storing lenses in here, I'll start with the biggest here. Got a 70 to 200 Canon 2.8 uh, lens here. Uh, go ahead and push that all the way to the bottom. Fold the, the cap closed. Once I have the cap zipped up tight, I've got these four uh, webbing cinch straps around each side. And I just go around, make sure they're all cinched down. They've got elastic cuffs so that the, the webbing uh, doesn't dangle off the sides of it. Holds it in there, it's protected, and it's ready to go. Uh, if I wanna switch that out, uh, I can go all the way down to, this is a 24 to 70 here. Let's go ahead and insert that there. Once it's in there, zip the lid shut. And just like we did on the 70 to 200, go around, tighten these webbing loops until it's down, snug around the lens. And that's perfect size there. You've got the webbing or the elastic loops here to be able to secure these webbing uh, straps down so they're not dangling. Uh, for demonstration purposes, I'll just leave them like that right now. Uh, and then if I want to get into my 50 mil, I'm gonna loosen these up so it's a little bit easier to pull this out. Grab my 50 millimeter. Uh, this is the 1.4 lens. I can stuff that down in there. Zip this closed. And then I'm gonna cinch this all the way down around all four of these webbing cinch straps. Now that I have that in there, lens is tight, it's not moving and it's fully protected inside of there. Uh, to get it out, I'm just gonna loosen these up a little bit and say I wanted to be able to store more than one lens at a time. Uh, I'll go ahead and show you how to do that. I'm gonna start with the 24 to 70, so I'm gonna loosen these cinch straps up. Throw my 24 to 70, 2.8 lens in there. Throw this foam divider in there, the 50 mil, close that up, zip it up. Again, go around and tighten my cinch straps. You're ready to go. And this is the inflatable lens case. Works great with across all of our products. You can put it in the Provoke, any of the Hexad series, uh, the Veer packable backpack, um, and across any of our products.